Hello, and welcome to Code Blocks 8. Uh, today we're going to do something a little bit different in that we are going to start with what we did on Code Block, code block 7. Hopefully you remember your dog's name, because I named mine Spinning Thing. But I would like you to click on this little icon here, and it's your settings, and it gives you some options. I want you to duplicate it. And there we go. We now have a duplicate. And it even says up here, copy of spinning thing. I'm going to change this to double spinning spinning thing. I would like you to name it after your favorite food, though. OK, so <clears throat> this is what we started with. And let me remind you, this is what it looks like. Or this is how we ended it. I did manipulate it a little bit. First of all, I would like you to see that this right here, the tight area is on the top. I would like to move it down. So how would I do that? I'm going to change this to one, I believe it, and this to th 10. I think that will do it. Let me see if I remember if I you know, did this correctly. Oh, yes, it is changing it a little bit, but nope, it's not enough. See, I want it to go lower. So I'm going to make this negative. 10 and let's see if that'll do it i'm not sure if i see a lot of these you just have to play with the settings and see what you can get see now it's the bottom is thinner and the top is wider which is cool but today you're actually going to be um, adding another shape and the shape that i would like to add is i'm going to add a star and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy all the same information at first. So I'm going to duplicate, move, and then put it there. I would like for you to add, what could we add for you guys? Go ahead, go ahead and add a box. But you know, you might want to change the diameters or the parameters around it, the, the scale and the size because a box replicated I would suggest you make it skinnier first. Okay, great. So you're going to add a box to yours while I added a star. Let's see if I should change anything. I'm going to change this to, uh, I don't know, I think it's seven. And let's see what happens. All I did was copy the bottom part and put it up here. I'm going to reset this. Yeah, something weird here. As you can see, the scaling is making it look kind of long and weird looking. So. Not bad, kind of scary, kind of like a weapon, which I'm not sure I'm happy with that. So I'm going to change that to that. And maybe I don't want it to stick out as far. You know what? Let's change the rotation. And for you, what I would like you to do is actually have two separate shapes in your project. And I want them to be the colors, <coughs> Christmas colors, red and green. All right, that's not bad. I want to move the, the star down a little bit. And I really don't like the rotation, so I'm going to change this. I'm going to try to get rid of that one right there. I'm, and I don't want it to go so high up, so let me just change that to zero. And now let's see what happens. Oh, you see it's making the star over and over again. And in this case, that's actually not bad. So again, yours is going to be red and green. And I want your two projects to be one on top and one on the bottom. They can be connected, that's fine, but I want, I want to see one definitely on top, one in the bottom. That way I know that you're trying to manipulate these in a certain way. Now, the issue here is, you see where, how this part is underneath this? What I would see, when I see this, I think of the printing bed. For you, it's just the plane. It doesn't matter unless you're going to be printing this, but when you send it out, it will automatically, for most programs, just move it up directly. So there's that. And this time, when you're exporting it, or when you're sharing it with me, I would just like a screenshot. So it's kind of like a GIF. You're going to create an image. You're going to name yours, your file, Actually, the same as, as what you had before, right? Which was, who remembers? Anyone? That's right, your favorite food. But on the subject of the email, you're going to put 
CB8. CB8. That's right. I think should be an easy one today. Um, we were just playing with parameters, making sure one's on top, one's at the bottom. We have the certain colors. We didn't introduce any new blocks today, but I think you'll be having a good time because it's not that hard. Have a good day.